Hey guys, I'm back for some more Genshin Impact. Uh, and in today's video, I'll be showing why you shouldn't pull for Shenhe. And also, yes, that is the proper pronunciation, because that is how Shenhe says her, actually, uh, her actual name in the game. So don't say Shenhe, say Shenhe. Okay. So basically, I tested her out a, a couple times in the test run right there. She's a support. So, and she deals okay damage for her talents and stuff, but she's not that good, and I'll show you why. As a 5-star, she could be doing more. Okay, so, her E Transfiguration. basically sends her talisman for a little bit, dealing uh, uh, cryo damage. Basically, the, the thing that she really... <laughs> does is support ice characters. Okay, so we'll go to characters, we'll look at her kit. So, details. They built her for attack, and not really crit rate or crit damage. A bit of energy recharge. Look at. Let's look at the talents. Okay, so... Okay. So, it deals cryo damage, AoE cryo damage, I see Quill. When normal charged and plunging attacks, elemental skills and element elemental bursts deal cryo damage. The damage dealt his attack uh, is increased based on Shen Hei's current attack. So she basically just buffs cryo damage uh, with her icy quill status uh, in this in this uh, E. And then here. She deals AoE cryo damage, and then she creates a field, which decreases cryo res and physical res. So basically, you can decrease cryo res and deal more cryo damage. That's basically her, her, uh, her kit. And this, this actually deals some pretty decent damage. Like, look at this. This is some good damage. 300% is not bad. Kaya is our uh, cryo character that we have right now. So yeah, let's test it out. My will embodied. See, that's pretty good damage. Pretty good. Okay, we'll wait for her E to come back and then we'll do the thing. We'll put her Q first, her burst, uh, and then put her E, which will decrease res, and then her E will uh, increase cryo damage. So let's do it. Cryo incarnate. And then this. And then there. So only 3.5. Okay, 6.9. 7k. Okay, well, her her buffs are her buffs ended. So mm, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Let's look at how the damage is without. 2.4. 2.4. 2.4 1.2. So Shen He. Dodge this. More than doubles. Take your true form. She more than doubles the attack of cryo damage dealers. But she's a five star. You got to keep that in mind. Most people can't get five stars, and her attack is insanely high at three thousand. That's a lot of attack, and it's based on her attack. So I mean. It, you gotta build her for attack, which, I mean, it, it, no one's complaining about that, but, I mean, as a 5-star, the damage shields dealing isn't really that much. I mean, no, no, not the damage. Da the damage increase shields dealing isn't that much. That's what I meant to say. Okay, so, we'll wait to get her E and everything. Come a little closer. Okay, bubble. Come on, annoying bubbles. Bruh. Okay. Where is it? There it is. Okay. By ordinance divine. Transfiguration. Oh, so Okay, so 6.8, 6.9, 7k. That's the most Kaya's dealing. But before that, the most cryo the most damage Kaya was dealing was like 2k so like 3.5 times more damage mm, but that's with her her cryo res lower her, her her burst 
So let's do it with only her burst. Okay, so as of right now. Okay, 5.8k is the most. Cryo incarnate. Okay, and now let's look. 7k. So not really two times the more damage. Um, not not even close to two times more, but could be a result of crit rate and crit damage. Kai might have critted before. Let's do that again. By ordinance divine. Seven point three. 7.3. The most Kai is dealing is seven point three. Okay. That's only with that, though. Okay, let's increase Kaya's damage, but not to do the elemental shred. Oh, wait, no. Wait, I needed to hold. Oops. Wait. Almost got it. Okay. Transfiguration. 9.3k. So, obviously, the cryo damage increases more than... It's more effective. 9.3. Basically, Shen Hu's E. Take your true form. That is more effective for cryo damage dealers than her Q elemental uh, res shred. But again, if you do both of them at the same time, it will increase effectiveness. Of course, let's do it both at the same time. Oh wait, no. Yeah. Gotta. Gotta hold it. Of course, I'm I'm just noob, so. Take your true form. Cryo incarnate. Dodge this. Okay, eleven point five. So that's a clear that that's clearly working. Eleven point something k, much much better than Kaya's two three k without any of those buffs at all. You're in for a little shock. But. There is elemental mastery with this too. There is a lot of elemental mastery when this comes. Okay, so let me tell you. Wait, how much can Kai deal with elemental mastery and with the the damage thing? Nice and spicy. Okay. Okay. Freeze. Okay, with Vaporize, I think that was 5, 7k. 5 or 7k damage, which is pretty good. Do your master's bidding. My will and body. Oh, wow. Okay, 11.3k with elemental stuff. 7.8. Well, now the buff's ended. Uh, but the damage is just killing everyone. Um surrendering be gentle. <laughs> okay. Come on, don't die, don't die, don't die. Come on, come on, get the tornado out. Okay. Bruh. To be honest. Shen Ha deals more damage than Kaya does with all of Shen Ha's buffs. Which kinda sucks, to be honest. Uh, but then again, Kaya isn't really that strong in terms of DPS wise. It would work better with Ganyu or something. So here's the thing she's good at increasing cryo damage. Like, that's, that's a fact. But the fact that she's a 4 star. I mean, a 5 star. The fact that she's a 5 star makes it like, eh, is she really worth that? Um, like, I mean, though the animations are good, and everyone's like, uh, the, the attire she's wearing is really good. I'm not really a fan of this attire, though. But, there's a but. And I'm not talking literally. Don't, <laughs> don't, but. I mean, she's not really, not really doing it. I just feel like Yunjin's like way better because she's a four star. Most people can get a four star. Although I did talk about the pity system in that video. 
uh, and that she's not really guaranteed for unlucky players, but I mean, what's the chances? Like getting a guaranteed at like 180 pulls, like you're sure you're bound to get a Yunjin by then. But I mean, that leaves it with this video, honestly. Shen Shen has a decent character. We're leaving it at that. She's a decent character with good buffs. Decent character with good buffs. She can deal decent damage, buff pretty good, but she's just too rare. Like, that's the problem. That's too rare. I mean, if she's that rare, she should have a little bit better of a kit. Like, you know, we're playing with four stars, Kaya, Lisa, and Zhengling, so... I mean, it just kind of feels insulting. But yeah, I guess that's the video. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, I'll see you guys in the next video.